Hi there, my name is Mike Cotton and you found this page because you were wondering how to become a web designer. Um, I can tell you that I owned a web design business for five years and I am now a web developer. I don't do the design part anymore because I found that um, I have more of a passion for the programming aspect of everything. So a web designer um, kind of goes more into the graphic design and styling of a website uh, more than the background coding. So, and but a lot of people lump those two things together. A web designer um, can do both, and that's what I did for a long time. Um, to be a designer, you basically need to know graphic design. So, get Photoshop or something equivalent. If you're just starting out with graphic design, um, first of all, I don't know why you would want to be a web designer, but if you want to be a web designer and you want to get into the graphic design, there is a free program called GIMP, G-I-M-P. Um, it's not as good or as advanced as Photoshop, but it'll do a lot of what you would need to do, at least until um, things get going. I actually used that for my first year, I think, in my web design business. Um, so that's part of it, learn graphic design. Then you need to learn HTML, which is a, uh, uh, the website code. And that is how to lay out a web page, um, how to show columns and tables and, and how to put a header at the top and a footer at the bottom and all that. That's HTML and CSS is another um, kind of a language that you need to learn. And it is more for styling. And the CSS you put inside of an HTML file um, and then that makes the colors like you can make the background color a solid black with just CSS. You don't have to create images for that and stuff like that. So, and actually, uh, browsers these days do a lot without having to create graphics. You could do gradient, uh, colors. You can do, um, uh, opacity, um, like make something see through. Um, there's a lot you can do with browsers with CSS only, but you'll have to know the graphic portion of it as well. Now there are some tools out that are a big help, huge help to web developers and web designers, I should say. Um, there is a a platform called, I guess you would call it platform, a template, a it's a platform, I guess, called uh, Bootstrap. It's actually uh, what Twitter is built on, and it's a, a grid system basically. Um, in when you set up a web page, you, you most likely want columns, or you want things center, or you want things to uh, span the entire website or just a small portion of it. Well, Bootstrap has you covered. You, it's a bunch of files like CSS files and JavaScript files, which is the programming part of it, that um, will give you a head start basically on creating a website. If you're not into the coding part and all that, this really helps. If you learn Bootstrap, it will take you places in web design. So. Um, that's a huge advantage right there. Also, if you want to get into the coding, jQuery um, is a great JavaScript uh, platform as well. And jQuery and Bootstrap work hand in hand. Um, and there's a lot of built-in plugins like um, pop-ups and drop-downs, uh, menus and stuff like that that are built into Bootstrap that use jQuery. So those two things um, alone will just save you a whole bunch of time on learning, especially if you're starting off, if you don't want to do things from scratch. I use them all the time, and I've been doing this for years and years, you know, um, probably coming up on probably almost at least 12 years or so. So um, that is my suggestion to you. Get into graphic design, get Photoshop if you can, uh, or get GIMP, um, and start learning. Uh, actually, go out to websites that you love and try to build one. Try to mimic it. Try to figure out what they did and create the graphics your own. And don't don't just download them. Create them or clone them um, from scratch. And that will make you a better graphic designer. I got pretty good at it, but I just didn't like it. So I love the programming. Um, but um, And now I'm a full-time web developer. I work from home. Um, I also own an internet marketing business. And uh, that business is, um, is just... is building and actually if you're looking to start a web design business uh, this might be something you can do to help support you um, while you're getting started is a business that I'm in if you want to check it out and join me 
Um, you can check out some of the projects I'm working on as far as development and web design. I'm kind of doing design too, but um, you can check that out and also join my team um, on the business we're working on and is making people a lot of money. So um, if you're interested in that, go ahead and click the button below this or the link below this. If you're on YouTube, there should be a link. Uh, but uh, check out what I'm doing and um, uh, message me if you want, if you have any questions and all that. So anyway, I'll talk to you soon. See ya.